Shalom friends. I have received many requests to define some of the terms that I use in DAF Reactions videos. So I'm delighted to welcome you to the very first installment of the DAF Reactions Dictionary. Let's go. DAF. A DAF is a page. In this case, one double-sided folio page of the Babylonian Talmud. DAF Yomi. A cycle of learning the whole Babylonian Talmud at the rate of one page per day. Daf Yomi takes seven and a half years to complete. So at this rate, I only have five years left. The Mishnah. Rabbinic Judaism not only has the Torah, the five books of Moses, but also the oral Torah. This was spoken and taught from one generation to the next. Unfortunately for everybody, the Roman Empire happened. They destroyed the temple in Jerusalem. They occupied Judea. They enslaved a ton of us. They stole our menorah, and generally speaking, just fucked up all of our shit because the Roman Empire sucked. You can quote me on that. Thus, our oral traditions and teachings had to be written down so we could preserve them. That's what the Mishnah is, compiled around the year 200 CE. The Gemara. The Gemara began to be compiled around the third or fourth centuries. It is debate, discussions, and analysis about the teachings in the Mishnah. It is the record of hundreds, thousands, of rabbis talking, arguing, across generations. There are more opinions than could be counted. That is truly a plethora of hot takes. The Talmud. The Talmud is the Mishnah and the Gemara together, garnished with additional commentary and insights arranged around the main text on the page. Technically, there are actually two Talmuds. The first is Talmud Yerushalmi, the Jerusalem Talmud, and the later one is the Babylonian Talmud, Talmud Bavli. In my view, the best analogy for the Talmud is actually the internet. The Mishnah is like a main article on a website. Then you've got the Gemara, which is the comment section on that article. Then you have the additional commentary, which is like a multi-part tweet thread about both the comments and the article itself. Baraita. Sometimes there's a teaching from the Mishnahic era that somehow did not make it into the Mishnah director's cut. That is called a Baraita. I hope my phone's autocorrect is listening to this because frankly, I'm tired of telling it that I'm never typing the word barista. It's barita, okay? But then again, it also thinks I'm constantly typing the word duck. I'm not. Stay tuned for more terms to come in parts two through 10 billion, I assume, of the Duff Reactions Dictionary.